Levels to be the same rating. I just don't know what the correct rating is for both of those. Probably insane, but I don't know. Nice, there we go. Epic win. Phenomenal. Let's go, dude. All right, that that was literally four four minutes from zero today. Definitely practiced that well. Let's see. I think fourteen of these are old attempts. I I don't remember which one of these. It's either fourteen or forty six of these are old. I, I don't remember which one it is. But a bit like, like eight fifty attempts around. That's fair. I'll take these. This is a good level in my opinion. Definitely a solid deadlock remake. I know it used to be like really hard, but like now it's like pretty fair and enjoyable. I mean, the only issues I had with this level are like the one ship gap in, at like 30 where you have to go between like the, the, the like the blocks with all like the chode spikes on them that are like rotating in like a square. Though that gap is hard, but I found a consistent lineup. If you just do like a, a light ish click at the very end of the straight fly right before it, you're generally lined up pretty well to get through the gap with enough downward momentum to survive. That and at the first corridor of the boss fight, there's like, well in, in each of the wave, uh, in the lasers, there's like a wall preventing you from going the other ways as the wave. And for the first boss attack, that wall extends into the, the area where you have to spam as the mini wave. It's not that big a deal, but like, it's an issue, you know? It didn't kill me from zero though. I only even got there twice. Like I only had two attempts at the second half. The first one I died at 77 because my nose was itching. <laughs> and I when I just like the very start of the wave and then I beat it the next attempt. Like it's very consistent. Good, good level for sure. I would recommend this one. I would recommend this one, yeah. Alright, that's about all I gotta say. GG's.